Hi, today I'm reading from this book and it's a fable called Town Rat and Country Rat. The town rat and the country rat were friends. One day, the town rat went to look for his friend. He set out early. The sun was just coming up over the hill. When he got to the country, the sun was way up in the sky. He was hot, tired, and hungry. But there was no sign of his friend around the place. So the town rat sat down to rest under a tree. It was cool under the tree. The place was so quiet that he soon went to sleep. After a time, the country rat came home. Hello, he said to the town rat. Did you get here early? You must be tired and hungry. Let us have something to eat. We can go into the corn shed. The town rat looked afraid. Is it safe? He asked. Everybody's out working in the fields, said the country rat. People get up early and work in the fields till the sun goes down. So they went through the long grass into a big shed behind the farmer's house. The shed was full of corn put out to dry. The town rat looked around. Is that all you have to eat, my friend? Corn, corn, corn. I want the food that the people eat. I don't like to go into the house, said the country rat. It isn't safe. Well, I can't eat this old corn. Come with me to the town. In town, we can get nice food to eat. So the country rat set off to town with his friend. They went through the field and woodland until they came to town. It was night when they got there, but there were lights everywhere. There were people up and down on the streets. I don't think I like it here, said the country rat. There are too many people and too many lights. We do not live by the sun here, said the town rat. But do not be afraid. I know what to do. They went into a house to look for food. They saw a lot of food set out on a table. It looked lovely and smelled very good. Well, this looks good, said the country rat. The two of them climbed up on the table and started to eat. The country rat was having a good time. Then a lot of people came into the room laughing and talking. The rats jumped off the table and ran. The country rat ran out of the house. As he ran into the street, a car nearly hit him. Come back, come back, the town rat called after him. But the country rat did not stop. He ran until he was right out of the town and in the country. He did not stop till he got back to his home. The night was cool and quiet. He was so tired that he had to sit and rest for a long time. Then he went into the corn shed. Town rat can stay in the town with his nice food and pretty lights. I will stay in the country and eat corn and go to my bed early. I am safe and happy here. The end. So this fable just shows us sometimes we might see people with other stuff that we don't have that even appear to be better than what we have. But the best thing is to always be satisfied with what you have, right? At least I gather that's the moral of this story. What do you think? Leave a comment below. Share it with your friends. Click like if you liked to the story. And don't forget to subscribe if you have not yet done so. Thank you for watching. Bye.